Shit. There she is. Oh shit, she really is following him. Glarthier, you fucking genius. You fucking knew it all along. Glarthier knew. Oh, I thought she was about to talk to the town guard. Oh shit, look, now Glarthier is following her. What the hell? Dude. Let's see. I need to see what she does. Can't you huh? see that I'm very busy? So long. <laughs> Alright, let's go inside and see what the fuck she's up to. We'll be very inconspicuous, just sneaking around in that gigantic full suit of metal armor, clinging and clanging everywhere. <laughs> She'll never suspect a fucking thing. Look at us. We're fucking inconspicuous as hell. <laughs> hey gang, what's good? Welcome back to Oblivion. We're here at the Skingrad Mages Guild. Kind of a weird name, Skingrad. I don't know, sounds kind of gross, doesn't it? Anyway, we're out here. We're doing the recommendation quest. We gotta go find... Arathor, right? Yeah. For Adriana. Brené. Yeah, alright. Well, let's go look for this dude. Look, we have actually a multitude of quest uh, points here going on. What the hell's... What is all this? Look. Look at this. There's so many different uh, pips showing up. Jeez, what is up with that? Are we somehow tracking multiple quests at once? Let's see. Eh, I don't know. Just some Ratings weird stuff going on. Mate. Oh, right. Hold up. Yeah. I should speak with the other guild mages to learn about it, to learn his whereabouts. Jeez, completely forgot that. Damn, I'm dumb. All what right. What do you want? I want to know about Arathor. I haven't seen him in quite some time, but then, this isn't the first time he's been away, so I wasn't really that concerned. Okay. Oh, <laughs> well, that was fairly innocuous. Fair enough, Take I guess. Uh, also, in between videos, did some inventory management per, par, uh, part of the course. You know, we had a whole lot of stuff. Uh clogging up the uh, the old uh, inventory artery, so to speak. Cleared that uh, sucker on out. Anyway, let's talk to this guy over here, too. I hear you got quite a task from Adriana. Yeah. Have to find Erthor. A nice enough guy, I suppose, but there was that awful scamp incident last year. Oh, no. That's when Adriana told him he needed to practice somewhere else. Oh, no. Somewhere else. Meaning somewhere far away. Oh, shit. So we settled down in Bleak Flat's cave. Did all his work there and came back to town twice a week to check in. Hasn't been around lately, though. Huh. Okay. Well, tell me about Bleak Flats Cave. What does he do there with these scamps? Is this guy just, like, summoning in a shitload of scamps and just banging in them? Or is he just, like, having some wild sex parties with scamps? Shit, dude. I want in on that. Oh, dear. I just can't seem to remember where that is. What a shame. What an ass! All right. Jeez. Let's see. We're going to have to do the old Hocus Pocus. Tell me some Moas. Let's see. Where is our Captivate? Here. Is it alphabetical? Yeah, it is. All right. Dope. If you need me. Yeah, here. Help me. Good Boom. day. Yeah, I gave you the oven mitt of truth. Oh, dear. I just can't seem to remember where that is. All right. Maybe he literally can't remember. Maybe that's the case. Let's ask him about the Mages Guild and stuff. The Guild can provide you with some training, but the best trainers are usually very hard to find. Hmm. All right. Tell me a rumor. I can't believe a Mages Guild associate was found dead in Chaden Hall. What kind of place are they running there? <laughs> All right. Tell me about Skingrad. Have you met Adriana Berena, our Skingrad Mages Guild head? Not the most pleasant person, I'll admit. <laughs> Don't mind her. Interested in training? <laughs> I do the conjuration courses, and Druja does the mysticism. All right, yeah. Don't have you met her? Don't mind her. I'm here to. All help right, you know. okay, sure. Maybe, uh, maybe Druja over here actually knows about the cave. What? Druja, have you heard of Bleak Flats Cave? It's just northwest of Skingrad. Here, see it on the map. All right, I That's get it. That's where Erthor wound up after Adrian told him he couldn't practice in the Guild Hall anymore. She probably doesn't even remember that. Hmm. You might want to make sure she remembers, especially the part about it being her idea. <laughs> All right, yeah, I gotcha. Sure, I'm picking up what you're Good laying down here. Finding Erthor. Yeah, I'll find... Wait, I thought it was Erithor. Eh, Erthor. You're here about that recommendation, I presume. I'll need to speak with Erthor before I write it. 
Yes, I'm here about the recommendation. I need to tell you about Bleak Flats Cave. I think Erthor's there summoning scamps and, like, doing tons of moon sugar with them. Oh, I do remember telling him to go there. Mm. Mm. Well, we'll just have to do something about <laughs> that, won't we? By we, I mean you, of course. I have something that may help. It's a basic fireball spell. You want me to blow them up? In case you need to defend yourself. I'll All be right. here when you get back. Good luck. Sure. Okay. Damn. Well, let's go over there and blow up Erthor, I guess. Jesus. Let's see. How much damage does this uh, fireball do? Weak fireball. Five points damage in five feet for three seconds. Oh. All right. So it's some damage over time effect. All right. Well, that is better than our uh, current doohickey, ain't it? Only 12... Look, it's only one extra mana, but it does, it does a significant amount more damage, doesn't it? Here, should we test it out in here? Are they going to get mad? Ba-boom! Oh, jeez, look at that. What an explosion. All right, let's head on the hell out of here. Go look for Bleak Flats Cave. Oh, my gosh. Always with the Bleak Caves, huh? Bleak Falls Barrow, Bleak Flats Cave. Jeez, I'm Pete. They don't know when to quit. Oh, look at that. It's right uh, right over there, up uh, at the, where the S and the K meet. Oh, beautiful. All right, let's head on over there. Hopefully, we don't run into any, like, horrific, monstrous gobos along the way. Good God. I wonder if we actually do need to make use of this spell, you know? When we're out there, we may need to actually ignite some sort of explosive and blow some shit up. Find some red barrels, you know what I'm saying? Blow some of that crap all all the way to uh, the freaking uh, Plains of Oblivion. Damn, dude. Sure. I mean, hey, I don't mind being a Dunmer and all. Man, I'll just eat that shit up. Oh, look at this. Wow, look at this beautiful farm area. Oh, look at that. That is gorgeous. I really love all of the farms and stuff, you know? Good lord. Like the idea of seeing... Oh, shit. What is that going on over there? Huh. Just some wild-ass sheep and someone walking by. All right. Oh, God. Now, if this were more when these people would be slaves. <laughs> Raymond Broder. Retired archer, presently oh. a grape grower for the Cerilles at your service. Fantastic. Are you looking for advanced <laughs> training? Uh, no. What What would you train me in? What do you do training in? Grape, or I guess archery, huh? Much I can show you. <laughs> I don't know why I assumed he would just train me in being a farmer, <laughs> but hey, it is what it is, huh? Tell me about skin grab. I served as a legion marksman for 20 years. I retired here to Skingrad, work in the vineyards, and supplement my income as an advanced trainer. Huh. Wow. You got it all figured out, dude. I served. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's just lit up again for some reason. Take Fair it. enough. Man, must be fucking peaceful as hell to work on a farm. Ex I mean, especially if you have, like, income to fall back on if you ever have, a, like, a bad harvest. Because that's really the only main stressor of uh, the farming life, right? Uh, is, you know, hey, oh man, one, one of these seasons, uh-oh, shit went real bad. Went real bad, storm came in, screwed me over. I don't know, something like that? Ooh. But nonetheless, it seems real freaking relaxing, right? Wouldn't mind having, like, a little garden or something one day in the future. Yeah, man, that would be pretty damn great. Just growing some stuff? I don't know if I'd ever want to eat the shit that I grow. I mean, jeez. No, me, it'd probably, like, grow me, like, a, a third eyeball or something. But then again... Damn, that sounds pretty dope. Maybe I do want a third eyeball. Holy shit, could you imagine that? Oh my god, by the all-seeing eye of Agamotto. Whew. Jeez. Where the hell is Prior Mabel, by the way? No, oh shit. Oh man, I thought this was like Bungler's Bane, but it's actually Yellow Cinnabar Polypore. Hmm. Unfortunate, but uh, eh, I'll take it. Ain't no Bungler's Bane, but damn, it'll have to do. Jeez, look at this. It's getting kind of, uh fiery out here, like there's some sort of forest fire. Like, uh, there's, a uh, Oblivion Gate about ready to pop open over here. But no? Just, uh, just some sort of, like, calm-ass hillside. Man, this is very quaint. You could just imagine old Geralt of Rivia rolling right through here, fighting some sort of horrific griffin screaming bloody murder at him. Oh shit, we're already here. Is that... Is this it? It looks... Huh. <laughs> the marker is a little off. Alright. Well, what the, what the heck is this thing here? What is this? An Aetherius stone. The hero's fate is known when the hero's fame has grown. Huh. All right. Jeez. Wonder what that's talking about. I guess our, our fame rating down here. They'll, it'll give us some kind of buff once our fame goes up. Jeez. All right. I'm down with that. What is our current fame? Already at eight. Man, that ain't half bad. Jeez, it takes a while to get some fame in, uh, in the old Morrowind land. 
There wasn't a, a fame rating in in Skyrim, was there? Huh. I suppose uh, they tried to make it more to where NPCs reacted to your fame, right? They'd be like, "Oh, you must be the the head of the College of Winterhold or something like that." Did they do that? I can't remember. Good lord, it's just been too damn long. I say that every damn time I think of Skyrim Land. All right, let's see. Look at this fucking cute little hobbit hole, huh? Na 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 na. Wait, that's. <laughs> That's just Elder Scrolls music that I'm doing there. All right, Bleak Flats Cave. Here we go, baby. Boom. Torches out. Fireballs on the tip. Bam. Ready to roll. Now, what do you think we're going to find in here? Probably a shitload of pissed off scamps, huh? Doped up on moon sugar. Oh, shit. Speak of the... Oh, what the fuck? That ain't a scamp. That's a naked man wobbling around in the fucking darkness of the cave. There's a naked man in here in decent exposure. Someone arrest this man. Ooh. Jeez, look at him. What are you doing, fella? Hey, how's it hanging? Let's quick save here. Maybe we can actually sneak up on him. Damn. Oh no, we can't. Ugh. It's a deranged zombie. Can zombies even be deranged? I mean, how does that work, huh? Zombies being deranged and shit? I don't know. I've never heard of that. Can we actually block this guy pretty well? Eh, not really. I was thinking, hey, good opportunity to level up the old block. Well, maybe we ought to be careful. Uh-oh, that's a mistake. That was a damn mistake. Woo! All right, let's finish this guy off before he gets us, huh? Scampy, do some shit. Finish him, Scampy. Oh my gosh. Woo! There you go, Scampy. Yeah, give him what for. Whoa, he's doing a, like a super sweeping cleave AoE attack. Come on, Scampy. Give him what for. Yeah, there you go, dude. Damn. Good old Scampy. <laughs> Comes in handy in a damn pinch. Hero of the day, right? Damn. Scampy, what a damn legend. All right. Let's whip out the old torch. Oh, look at this. Got some big old cairn bolit. Ooh, delicious. I don't know if I would actually eat one, though, come to think of it. Man, look at this guy. Ugh. Jeez. Man, got some real, like, mucus... Dick, like, fell off? Either his dick fell off, or her tits fell off, I don't know. Jeez, something happened here. <laughs> something real bad happened. Alright, or maybe also, hey, maybe this isn't like a, a human or an elf. Maybe this is, uh, well, no, it would have to be at least a human, right? Look at the, uh, the ears, huh? Are all zombies human? That's something to think about. Oh my god, look at his super fucked up hand. Oh, shit. This looks like fucking I'll get you next time, Gadget. Shit, dude. Oh my gosh. No wonder he hurt like hell when he swiped right at me. My god, these zombos have got some fierce claws going on. Oh shit. Look at this. This looks ominous as shit, man. Oh, another zombo. Alright, let's tango, dude. I'm ready to go. Look, should we try out her, uh, her destruction spell? Maybe we should try that out. Just throw a couple weak fireballs, huh? Boom! You like that? Boom! Oh! He's really resistant to it. Scampy, you know what to do. Yeah, that's right. Tank for me, baby. I'll just come on and slice up his booty butt. Bam. Oh, looking great. Look at this. We're just knocking him all over the fucking place. What a damn idiot. Bam. Look at Scampy. Scampy just charging in for the shoulder checks like some sort of fucking backline. My god, Scampy, you're doing me fucking proud. Except you've just died and dissipated into the ether, Aether. Ooh! Man, remember when we were fighting zombies before and they were, like, scary as shit? Oh my gosh, now that we have our, like, cadre of amigos and pals and friends, geez, they ain't nothing, are they? I mean, then again, this guy is taking forever to just chop up, huh? Even with my fantastic chopping axe. Ugh. Oh, oh, whoa! There we go. Got him. Weird. Had bone meal on him. Huh. That is definitely a weird one. All right. Let's see. Should we repair up? Yeah, we ought to do that. Get some of that uh, fantastic repair XP going on. Jeez. 70-something percent. All right. My God. Whip out the old torch. Ugh. Oh, look at this. What was this zombie doing in here? It was raging out. Man, this is... With a furious rage, the zombie lashed out at the barrels in the crates. Fucking old bastion land over here, huh? Weak potion of agility. 
Uh, that's not really that useful for us, huh? We don't really do the old uh, marksmanship, huh? Alkanet flower. Oh, beautiful. All right. Oh, shit. Look who it is. It's another fucking Zombo. What do you know? All right. Let's go, Zombo. I'm ready to jam. Boom. Yeah, Scampy is here to tank like nobody's business. Look at this Zombo. <laughs> Good thing we aren't actually fighting. Oh, no. Scampy, you've done a pull. You've done a fucking vicious-ass pull. And I think I've accidentally just struck you. I'm sorry, Scampy. I'm very sorry. Uh-oh. Zombos are coming in. They're coming in hot. Oh! Jeez, Scampy is taking it there, man. Poor Scampy. Woo! Shit, man, I'll chop off your freaking arm. I'll make you a one-armed zombie. Yeah, try and grow that back. Do zombies have, like, regenerative powers? You'd think so, with their ability to, like, stay alive. Maybe zombies would have, like, some sort of superpower of regeneration. Got the old uh, Wolverine Deadpool situation. Look at these idiots. They're just clogging up the, uh, the fucking tunnel here. Jeez. Let's get some fucking super colon blow in the form of myself and Scampy. Bam. Eat your Wheaties, motherfucker. Ooh, shit. Ooh. There we go. They really go for, like, a super bear hug attack, don't they, when they want to jam out? Oh, gosh. It ain't good that they keep, on um, like, swapping places. It means it's kind of fucking tough for us to, like, focus them down, right? Like, see, look. They're at about the same health. Jeez. If this were, like, a uh, raid encounter, <laughs> man, it wouldn't be too great. Just leaving them both up like that? My god, come on, that's like tanking and pulling 101, huh? All right. Let's heal up here. Boom, there we go. Oh. Nice. Fantastic. Let's quick save. There we go. All right. Who the heck else is down here? More more zombos, probably? Probably. Notice how there is, like, a weird misty zombo coming out from down here. Where do you think this dude sourced all of the bodies from, by the way? Because that's another thing. When it comes to bodies, from when it comes to zombies, you gotta have bodies, right? Ooh. What in the world? Huh. The wall won't shift. Well, look at that. Well, that seems suspicious as damn hell. Probably be some sort of a uh, shortcut back out, right? Another one of those fantastic looping dungeons I love so much. Damn, look at that. Genius. You know what? You see all the, uh, all of the big old cobwebs. There's no uh, big enemy spiders, huh, in Oblivion, right? Right? That, w that wasn't until old Skyrim land. Well, there are, all the, are like the demonic titty spiders, right? Yeah, those things are real fucking... Uh, they're a real fucking piece of work, aren't they? Jeez, I'm Pete. The titty spiders? Jeez. Who thought that up? Man, whoever thought that up was horny as shit. <laughs> it's like some classic fantasy bullshit, huh? <laughs> Just like some sort of uh, super sexy monster with major tit action going on. <laughs> Good God. <laughs> All right. Let's head on down this uh, freaking tunnel. See if there's any more zombos down here. Jeez. Take it this guy has just went full on necromancy action, huh? Yeah. Seems that way, doesn't it? Alright, Scampy, let's go. Boom. I like the idea of using Daedra, though. You know, I feel like it ties in very well to my, uh, my Dunmer roots, right? We love to worship them, Daedra. The good ones, sometimes the bad ones, and all in between, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit! Gosh! It's really fucking unfortunate when they just whip around and give me a fucking big old blast right in my noggin. Oh, man. You'll notice how, like, we're able to really take some hits. Thanks to our, uh, our keen focus on leveling the old endurance, right? Man, there we go. Surprisingly, no mort flesh. Oh, gosh. Scampy, you scared me. I thought I wasn't going to be able to wait. Yeah, surprisingly, no mort flesh on these dudes. Man, look at this big-ass shroom, dude. Holy hell! Jeez, that's like a world record right there. Alright, let's quick save. I mean, then again, yeah, what, what the fuck am I even saying? Someone go to a fucking Vardenfell, check out all the shrooms there. Holy shit. Now that's a place with some big-ass shrooms, am I right? Alright. Let's freaking jam on these fools. Look, should we try out our- Nah, we may as well just conserve our, uh, our mana for more scampies, right? I think that's a good idea. Ooh! Jeez, Scampy, you're really getting messed up here. There we go. Another Scampy. There we go. Oh, 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 this guy wants to jam. All right, that's fine by me. Man, we probably should have repaired up our thing. Forgetting how much, uh, how much durability we run through chopping up these freaking Zombos. Good lord, we need, like, a chainsaw or something. 
Need like a freaking old Ash Evil Dead. Gosh, what was his last name? <laughs> I only remember him being Ash. Old freaking ugh, Ash Ketchup or some shit. <laughs> it's a different one. All right, Whew, there we go. Jeez, let's check out our levels. We've leveled up a few times in here, haven't we? Yeah, look, we're already a third of the way there, or two thirds of the way there, I should say. My bad. Gosh, in between videos, we may actually just level up. Damn, consider that. Holy shit. Friggin', our, the levels are flying by now. Man, let alone, especially once we get endurance all the way up. Holy shit, we're gonna just be leveling like crazy. Because we have all these levels that we can actually control very well. But for now, it's it's kind of, you know, slapdash, because we've got a lot, a lot of things that just kind of occur, don't we? Yeah. Alright, let's see. Let's whip out the old torch, that way we can have a nice little scout around. Smell around some of this hay. They had a whole bunch of, like, crates and stuff of... Just hay, I guess. I don't know what zombies would want to... From hay, maybe there's some zombie fucking horses down here. Oh, jeez, look. This is how you know someone's like some kind of evil sorcerer. <laughs> they pull out the candelabras. Next thing you know, we're going to hear some, like, classical music with organs. Oh, shit! Is it him? Oh, man, that's spooky as shit. Hey, man! Hey! Here, Thor, what the fuck, dude? <gasps> Help! Help! You've got to do something! What? They're all gone? I can leave the cave? Oh, thank you. I'm ever so grateful. Aerithor. You're heading back to Skingrad, aren't you? Could I maybe come with you? It'd be safer, I think. So, what do you say? Oh, man, Erthor, I thought you were like some sort of evil necromantic summoner. Holy shit, where'd all these zombies come from? Dude, there were a lot of zombos in here. All right, Arathor, you can follow me back. Oh, thank you. You're just too kind. Arathor's gonna die. <laughs> All right. Uh, tell me about the Mages Guild, Arathor. The service is provided at the Arcane University. Are just priceless. You can create your own enchantments. There. I know. That's what I want, dude. I want that so much. I want to put some like protect things on me. I want to get some like resist magic. All that shit, dude. Tell me a rumor. The Mages Guild runs more or less like it always did. But we lost quite a few members when the practice of necromancy was banned. Ah, okay. Well, follow me, Arathor. I'll be right behind you. All right, cool. Arathor, you better not stab me in the freaking back. back. In Skingrad, safe and sound. I can't... Too bad I can't fucking ask Arathor about all this shit that's going on. Look at this. Look, he's got like... A, oh, man, it's stealing. Damn it, Arathor. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Look. Lord Jornabret's Last Dance. My God, look. Fucking Arathor here, he's just gonna tattletale the crap out of me if I try and s just take all of his trash, huh? Jeez. Doskin shoes? He's got an extra pair of pants and a shirt? My god. And he even brought a fucking crystal ball. My god, these wizards and their crystal balls. I mean, I guess we're kind of a wizard now. Maybe we need to get up on this crystal ball situation. Oh, look, this one we can actually take from. Only 17 gold, though. What a freaking ripoff. Damn it, Arathor. Damn it. Oh. Oh, here we go. Yeah, this lever. Which has, like, spikes on it? Jeez, that seems dangerous. Alright. Oh. Are there any, like, uh, interesting enemies? Is another guy with, like, huge eyebrows gonna pop out and just scream at me? Just start screaming like, Oh, you shouldn't have done it! I knew you were here doing what the fuck! I'm pissed as shit! I got massive eyebrows! I knew I, I had to come along and ruin everything! Oh, I'm out of shit! And he just fucking has a conniption fit and just starts lashing out and getting pissed as shit and his eyebrows grow like 50 times bigger and I have to fight him in some sort of horrific boss battle make use of the fireball. Oh my god. Fucking that guy was pissed as shit. What a fucking character. Arathor, are you, you know about all this stuff? Have I ever told you about this fucking eyebrow guy? Oh my god. I was in this dungeon, right? Fighting a whole bunch of skeletons and stuff. Trying to get this lady's amulet, because she was, like, going a little senile, but we were trying to help her out. And once you know it, bam, right at the end there, Arathor. Oh, my God. I got stabbed in the back, almost, by some guy with gigantic eyebrows. They were so huge, Arathor. These eyebrows were humongous. Hang on, Arathor. Okay, you got you got regular people eyebrows, right? All right, we're down with that. That's, oh, shit, Arathor, are you about to backstab me? Arathor, are you fucking backstabbing me? Oh, no, look at that. Damn, Arathor! Do you want to be recruited? Holy shit, dude. Look at that. I've been trying to do this forever. Oh, no, wait. This is a rat. Okay. Arathor, that's not as impressive, but still, 
I respect it, you know? If you want to join uh, Team Buccaneer, you want to join my pirate crew, dude, you are fucking invited for sure. Look at this. We're going past this cool-ass looking rock. Erthor, have you seen this fucking rock? Look at this shit, dude. It looks like some sort of ancient shrine to old Lord Dagon. You hear about that Lord Dagon, by the way? <laughs> what a character. I hear he's, he's uh, you know, getting ready for a big-ass comeback. He's gonna have a big old show in town. My god. Old Lord Dagon. Hail to him. Hail to the king, baby. Am I right, Erthor? No? No, you don't like that? I mean, you you do some conjuration. You gotta have some respect for Lord Dagon if you do that shit, right? Oh my gosh. Erthor, it's been great traveling with you, having someone to actually tell all this bullshit to. Because my god, I have been on a lot of fucking adventures, pal. Whew. I had a horse named Prior Mabel, and she has just disappeared. Actually, I think that might be her right there. Is that Prior Mabel right there? No. What the hell is that? Uh-oh. Erethor. <laughs> what the fuck? Erethor, this is my, my horse I was telling you about, Erethor. Is this impressive or what? Yeah, that's right, man. I go riding around on this cute little sheep. <laughs> oh, that is so damn cute. I wish you could, honestly. It'd probably break its fucking back with my massive steel armor. Poor little sheep. Good morning. Hey, good morning to you, too. Maybe this is his pet sheep. Jeez. Poor little guy. What are you doing out here? Do you talk? No, but you move in a weird way sometimes. Okay. Can we... Whoa, look at this sheep. Uh-oh. What, what the hell's going on? Uh-oh. Oh, jeez. Oh, what are we... <laughs> what is going on here? Oh, God. Look at that. Hold up a second. Hold up. <laughs> What's gonna happen if we... Oh. No? Nothing? Okay. What if we do this guy? Oh, man. This guy must be really high level, huh? Erethor, how about you? No? Man, nobody fucking respects my uh, casting ability, Erethor. I even tried to put it on you. Don't judge me for it. You know, it was just an experiment. Please don't arrest me. I've been in jail before. It's not, it's not good in there. I don't like it. Let's see, did I actually incur- Okay, look. It's about to quick load. Oh shit, Erethor? Is this your- Over here! Erethor! Oh, we can't talk here. Too public. Meet me behind the Great Chapel at midnight. Don't let anyone follow you. I'll make it worth your while. Ugh. Are you- Are you soliciting me? Glarthir? Erethor, you're not supposed to follow me. Glarthir doesn't want- <laughs> Want anyone to see that I'm- performing some sort of sexual favor for him behind the- in the dark alley behind the chapel. What the hell, man? Jeez. What in the freaking world? This, this town is weird. Skingrad is pretty weird. I, I- I get why you wanted to get out of here, man. Let me tell you about this place called, uh... <laughs> well, shit, a lot of the places are pretty fucked up. You wanna go to Leowin? You're- you're not a- a Khajiit or an Argonian, so you might have an easier time there. <laughs> fucking Aerithor, jeez. All right, let's head on up in here. Gosh, maybe we just come in here and she's just surprised as damn hell to see Erethor walking Hello, around. Associate. Hey, check it out. Druja, it's Erethor. Audrian, I'm back. I was rescued. How the fuck do you say your name? So it would seem. You're unharmed, I presume? Well, my pride is a little wounded. Oh, spare me. You're lucky I bothered to send someone after you at all. <laughs> what an Major, asshole! Would you please be more careful? Uh, well, yes. I'll just pack up my supplies and be on my way then. Thank you for sending someone to help me. <laughs> Hello, guildmate. <laughs> Poor Have fucking you heard Arathor. Any word about the other provinces? Oh? They say that slavery has been abolished in Morrowind. Oh. House Dress and Lalu have renounced the slave trade and freed the beast folk from servitude. It is not surprising, considering Morrowind's violent past. We can only hope the troubles subside quickly. See you. Yeah, and there's that Take whole care. thing of the uh, the Argonians sort of doing that little invasion. Or has that not started yet? I think that has started, right? Man, good on him, though. I hope this is important, All right. Associate. Uh, hang on, Arathor. Ahead, please. What's what's up, Arathor? Do you want to... Let me tell you about this place called Wayne and Priory. You can go hang out there. Sometimes I bring, like cabbages and shit back you can chow down some cabbages and practice all your weird uh scamp summoning bullshit over there and like fuck up fuck a whole bunch of scamps and stuff my god it's a fucking party you're gonna love it 
They seem religious, but man, they're down with a lot of stuff, Arathor. They're I down with. Important, All right. <laughs> I don't even know how to say your name anymore, Adrian. Adriana? Adrian? Just, Go ahead, please. Jesus Christ. I brought. I brought. Uh, wait, what? I brought him back. Here's the recommendation. I brought back Arathor. Look, he's standing over there. I've spoken with Arathor, who seems to be all right. Good work. I'll see to it that your recommendation is sent in as soon as I have a free moment. All right, hopefully that's soon. As I soon. said, I'm rather busy. I'll get to it eventually, though, I assure you. All right. I I'm counting on it. You better not let me down. I'm going to be sad. You want to see a grown man cry? Because that's how you do it. Uh, you want to tell me about a rumor? I don't know what Archmage Traven has against necromancy, but the first thing he did after taking over the Mages Guild was to ban its practice. Hmm. I mean, it is kind of disrespectful, unless you got you were like working with volunteers, right? All right. Tell me about Glarth here. Yeah, this guy wanted to like. He thought I was a prostitute or something. Adrian, have you heard of this Glarthier dude? Glarthier. I don't mean to gossip, but he is more than a bit strange. However, he's always been tolerated as a town eccentric. Uh oh. Oh man, he is definitely soliciting me for sex. Well, well met, time to make a paycheck, baby. Let's go do it. Let's go suck off this fucking wood elf. Hell yeah, I'm not below it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Let's see. Paranoia. Here we go. I met a mysterious wood elf named Glarthier in Skingrad, who asked me to meet him behind the Great Chapel at midnight tonight. He wouldn't tell me what it was about, but promised to make it worth my while. Okay. Gosh, maybe he's just gonna try and sell me a fucking used stereo. Out of the back of his carriage or some shit. Fucking Glarthier. Jesus Christ. Let's go over and say hello to this idiot. What time of day is it? Oh, jeez, we missed midnight for sure. We'll have to go on over there and wait a whole lot of time. Oh, who is this person? This doesn't look suspicious at fucking all. Who are you? It's you. She's Hi. pickled? Who pickled you? Not so loud, please. What a headache I've got. I'm Agnet the Smith. The pickled, they call me. Sure wish I was pickled right now. <laughs> Whoa, okay. Uh, tell me a rumor. I like the Two Sisters Lodge, and Mog does a good job running the place. She and her sister are both fine people. All right, great. Tell me about Skingrad. Well, the local wine is great. It isn't cheap, but I don't bother with beer or ale anymore. And for a Nord, that's saying something. <clears throat> All right. Jeez. All right, see ya, Agnet. Goodbye. Hope you get pickled or something. Jeez. I'm surprised she didn't ask me for, like, 12 cases of Shadow Banish wine or some bullshit, right? Jeez. All right, let's see. Is this... This is the chapel area, right? We're gonna uncover some sort of dark secret. Either he's gonna, like, try and, like, I don't know, receive a sexual favor from me or sell me some sort of, like, used goods that, it, like, fell off the back of a truck or some shit. All right. Let's hang out here for, uh... Oh, my gosh. Let's see. Let's see. At least 12 hours, 9, 10, 11, midnight. Boom. Let's do it. Oh! Whoa! It just skipped to the end. Did you see that? A little bird Boom. told me that you've been asking around town about Glarther, a resident eccentric. I'd like to know why. What? Oh my gosh. He asked me to help him out. Just curious about him. Well, that's none of your business. Uh, hmm... Who the fuck is this guy, by the way? This is the town guard or something. Huh. That's none of your business, you bald asshole. Go go eat a dick. It is my business. Uh-oh. Allow me to introduce myself. Captain Dion of the Count's Guard. At your service. <laughs> now, you are telling me why you're interested in Glarther? Is this a fucking shakedown? Dion, are you trying to shake me down right here in the back of the chapel? What the hell? I'm just curious about him, you know. He just has... I like his hair. Unlike yours, Dion, you bald bastard. Fine. Play it that way. Let me give you some friendly advice. Glarther is crazy. Maybe harmless crazy. Maybe not. People say the same Don't thing about me. Don't get involved with him. If he asks you to do anything... strange, you come see me first. Got it? Or any of the town guard. Let us handle it. Why? What are you going to do to Glarthir? What the fuck is going on with Glarthir? Jesus, what does this say? Dion, captain of the Skingrad Guard, warned me not to get involved with Glarthir. 
saying that he was crazy and possibly dangerous. He also asked me to contact him if Glarthier ever asked me to do anything strange. Oh, what the hell? I mean, I kind of, I'm kind of down for that, honestly. All right, let's wait here again. Jeez. I thought we just got some kind of blessing here that allowed us to just, oh shit, here we go again. Someone else is going to interrupt my beautiful waiting time. Take this. You it's look like a vampire. A oh my God, you look evil as shit. What are you? Who are you? I don't have time to talk. Oh no, this is the town with the vampire guy, right? Oh no, mysterious note. Hey, I don't read them, I just deliver them. Oh my gosh, you look like a fucking old crone, Mirvana Arano? Oh my gosh, like an old crone that came out from an anime. <laughs> what the hell? I have things to do. <laughs> Aren't you glad we didn't install some kind of mod that changes the stupid Play-Doh looking faces? My god, we would have missed out on that. Why is everyone coming back here behind the chapel, by the way? I'm just trying to wait here in peace and do some shady shit. Jesus Christ. What? Finding the Thieves Guild? She's a member of the Thieves Guild, I guess. I was given a mysterious note by a mysterious Dark Elf. It offers greater wealth and less jail time. Maybe I should check it out. I have to wait until midnight and then go to the Garden of Dareloth. What is the Garden of Dareloth? Oh, shit, it's by the city. All right, my God, do you think it's because we got arrested? Oh, my gosh, maybe. Jeez, I guess getting arrested was actually one hell of a great idea. Holy shit, I had no idea. I thought you had to go talk to someone about this. I think that's how I tried to do it before. I can't remember. I think I had joined the mages, or the, not the mages guild, but the thieves guild before to use them as like a fence or something. I can't fucking remember. It's been too damn long. All right, good Lord. Let's try and figure this out again. Let's see. Oh my gosh, 12 hours, let's see. One, two, three. There we go. Whew, hopefully that's that's not too long. Good lord, anyone else? Anyone else want to come back here? This is supposed to be a very secluded area. Jeez. Alright, Glarthir. Hey, what's up, dude? What do you want to do? You want Ah, you came. Yeah. You sure you weren't followed? I don't think Good. so, man. I thought I could trust you. Nobody else in town. They're all in on it. All watching me. Oh, fuck them, dude. Well, yeah. yes. I need you to do something for me. I'll pay you gold. Oh, yeah. You like gold, don't you? Yeah, I do. Lots of gold. Oh, yeah. You're speaking my language. Here's my problem. I'm being followed. Watched. Marukati selectives, maybe. Oh, shit. Not what sure. the fuck is that? I'm a threat, you see. Uh -oh. To their plans. I know too much. Holy shit, this is big, dude. I need you to check out some people for me. Huge the ones true. who are following me. Watch them. See where they go. Who they report to. Will you help me? Oh, fuck yeah, Glarthir. Holy shit. Oh my god, we gotta get... We gotta do some shit about this, man. Hell yes, I'm gonna help. Very good. You won't be sorry. I'll pay you well. Did I say that already? No, <laughs> yeah, you did, Let's but you can't be said enough. Bernadette Penniless. Be outside my house at 6 a.m. You'll see her watching me. See where she goes and who she reports to. Oh my god. We'll meet here again tomorrow night. Oh, and never contact me in public. They're watching. They can't know you're helping me. Oh shit, okay. Okay, I, I, I understand, dude. This is some, like, fucking top secret, secret agent spy shit. Hell yeah, 007, hook me up. Yes, tell me about Bernadette. Pinelles. Her house is almost directly across the street from mine, southwest of the Great Chapel. Oh, fuck. I hope you mark it on my map. I don't think so. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. She's one of them. Tell me about Skingrad. There's so much I could tell you. So many secrets. But then you'd be in danger, too. It's best if we're not seen talking. Oh, shit. All right, Glarthir. Thanks for looking out for me, dude. Holy shit. I'm glad I got a pal yet like you with your glorious fucking mane. Oh my god, in that widow's Remember, peak. Bernadette Penelis, 6 a.m. Don't let her see you watching. Absolutely, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god, this is some fucking intrigue as shit. Holy hell, man. Oh my god, I'm excited as shit. Let's see, which one do we even go to? Which one? Is it this one? Uh-oh. It's the fucking town guard. They're on to me. 
Is he actually zooming in on my location? No. Okay, he's just on patrol. Just on patrol. <laughs> It'll be none the fucking wiser when I go start doing a fucking stakeout. Oh my god. Call me Mike Armentrout, because I'm here to do a little bit of private investigation. Damn. All right. Let's see. Which one is it? Is it this one? Is this her house? Yeah, this is it. All right. What do I have to do? Let's see. Believes, uh, yep. Uh, I need to be outside his house at 6 a.m. Let's see. See what she does. Wait. Bernardette? Huh. Oh, okay, yeah. See what she does. All right, sure. 6 a.m. Is this his house right here? Oh, it is. All right, sure. Well, let's hang out over here. Holy shit. Are you ready for this cloak and dagger ass shit going on? Oh, my God. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we are. Boom. Should be just in time to see what dark ritual she is up to. Oh my god, you know it can't be good. There's Glart there. He's making a move. Look at this, Glart there. Lure her out. That's right. Don't worry, I, I got your back, dude. I'm watching your six. Oh shit, look at this. Where is she? She's gonna pop out any second now. Just you wait. <laughs> Glarthier, I'm watching. Don't worry, dude. Wait, hold up. Where the hell is she? <laughs> Glarthier, she's not coming out. Glarthier, I don't... I think she might... Oh my god, Glarthier, what the fuck? Glarthier, are you... Oh, shit! There she is. Oh shit, she really is following him. Glarthier, you fucking genius! You fucking knew it all along! Glarthier knew! Oh, I thought she was about to talk to the town guard. Oh, shit. Look, now Glarthier is following her. What the hell? Dude. Let's see. I need to see what she does. Can't you huh? see that I'm very busy? So long. <laughs> Alright, let's go inside and see what the fuck she's up to. We'll be very inconspicuous, just sneaking around in that gigantic... Full suit of metal armor clinging and clanging everywhere. <laughs> She'll never suspect a fucking thing. Look at us. We're fucking inconspicuous as hell. <laughs> Alright. Shh. Quiet, bald guy. I'm spying on this lady. I think she's some sort of foul agent. Of the Thalmor or some shit. I don't know, dude. Let's come on up over here. Should we hide behind one of these pews? put out our torch. She might be able to smell our fires. That's right. Oh, what is she doing? Look at this. She's definitely up to some sort of dark ancient rite. Oh, what the fuck? <gasps> RK? Oh my god, look! She's praying to RK. Truly one of the worst guys around. Oh man. What an asshole. RK. You know, the one who's all messed up. He wears a red robe and he's got a staff. There's a big, like, glowing red dwarf sun all over his head and igniting his fucking beard. Oh my god, what a sinister kind of guy. There she goes. Wait, that's not even... Fuck me. That's not her. <laughs> that's not her at all. We're, we're fucking great spies, aren't we? Holy shit, we're the best in the fucking business, right? This is actually her sitting down the whole damn time. Oh shit, what do you think she's gonna do? Let's see. Glarthier believes that Bernadette Pinellas is following him. Is that her? I think that's her right there, sitting down. Look. Should we try and blow our cover and talk to her or something? I don't know. She doesn't seem to... She's just kind of been sitting here the whole damn time. Looking at this, uh... Like, weird picture of a guy who's part lion or some shit. Who is that? Is that Stendar? Hey. Lady in the green, don't look at me. I'm on a secret fucking mission. <laughs> look at us, we look so fucking stupid. <laughs> Alright, Jesus Christ. Is she gonna do anything amazing? Hmm. Well, she's just kind of hanging out here. Should we, should we maybe wait? Should we try and wait for an hour? I don't know, let's do it. Why the hell not? Oh look, there she goes. The eagle has left the nest. She's on the fucking well, move. Good to see you. Fattest Calidius sure can use a shield. I've never seen him take a hit. That's good go. to know. You can never be too careful. 
So I've heard. Fucking learning about shields and. <gasps> oh shit, we almost blew our fucking cover right there. Let's see, can we actually pickpocket her and like get some sort of wild shit off of her? Oh, look at this. She's got a hoe and a rake. Oh, Keep that's. Keep your fingers to yourself, thief. Oh shit, hold up. Let's quick load. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> we have to preserve our cover. Oh my god, look. Is she going for that? Nope. She took a swift left. Maybe she knows that I'm on her tail. Maybe she knows I'm tailing her. Maybe this is like one of those really fucking annoying Grand Theft Auto missions where you have to keep the car in some kind of like sweet spot. Look at this. I am a car. I am the car. I am Franklin, Michael, and Trevor all in one. Baby, hell yeah. Just keeping my distance despite the thing showing that I'm clearly being detected by someone. Maybe it's just that guy over there. Hopefully it is. Oh god, where is she going? Oh my god, what what the fuck kind of foul sorcery could she even be up to? Oh my god, I bet she's going to go and like start smooching with these guards or something. She's paying them off. They're on the pay list for the whatever the hell that group that guy said. Glarthier. What what group was it? The the Mabrigash initiates or something. No, those are those are the ladies from Morrowind who chop off people's dicks and eat them. But then again, maybe she also carries out that dark ritual. Ooh, I could see it for sure. She surely is up to something. <laughs> this isn't creepy at all, me stalking some woman. <laughs> Alright. Oh shit, let's sneak on out through this door to the West Wheel. Hopefully she's not just right on the other side again and looks around and is like, oh, She's behind the sheep! Shh. Quiet, sweet prince. I'm on a fucking sneaking ass mission. Look at that, you see her? Skin grad guard, do you see her? That's Bernadette. She's up to some real fucked up shit, dude. Yeah. You keep doing that. Keep looking fucking... Looking out, looking live. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, these are the Surreal Brothers Vineyards! Oh my god! She must be part of some fucking wine-smuggling thing. Oh my god, what if she's behind the Shadow Banish fucking wine? Hot damn. Oh my god, I could definitely see it. She looks like some kind of person who would come up with a... a oh, oh shit, she's coming around. Oh shit, what is she doing? Oh, she's going out there. Oh my god, she's going to collect the sacred grapes. The Grapes of Wrath. Oh! She's using her hoe! Or, or is it the rake? Oh, I can't see. I need, like, a telescope. Look, one of her spies is looking over here. Uh-oh. What's he gonna fucking do? He's on the fucking move, dude. Oh, shit. Is he coming over here? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is he on to me? <laughs> no, he's none the fucking wiser. You fucking idiot. Oh, shit. Oh, my gosh. What do you think she's doing out here? Yeah. Holy shit. Well, let's wait. Let's wait again, just like last time. We'll see if she... <gasps> Look, she's on the move again. Where the fuck is she going? Look, she's going deeper in. Oh, man. We're gonna sneak right by these fucking grapes. Hell yeah. Oh, shit. Look, don't mind if I do. Oh, delicious. Oh, my gosh. I love grapes. Grapes. Perfect for a stakeout mission. Gosh, where is she? She's really fucking legging it, isn't she? She's going fast as hell. She must know I'm in hot pursuit. Hot pursuit or something, but she's trying to keep her cool. <laughs> Little th do does she know. Oh my god, I know exactly what she's up to. <laughs> oh, look at this. Going up to the stables. Look. Oh my god. She has no fucking clue I'm out here hiding in the grapes. Hiding in the grape plants. Doing a little bit of reconnoitering. Oh my god. Look at this. This is ingenious. Galarthier, you fucking genius. You're, you've done it again. Oh my god. What a fucking madman. He's so... What an intellectual. Honestly. Oh shit. What is she up to over here? Oh shit. She's drinking some of her stolen goods. Oh my god. Some ancient shadow banish wine that's going to give her the powers of, of some sort of unholy beast. The ancient one. Oh, look at her fucking go. Look at that shit. Let's see, is this another situation where we have to wait? <laughs> For fuck's sake. What the fuck am I doing? What is going on? 
What kind of a quest is this? Let's wait again. Oh my god. Oh shit. Man, she took two hours to drink and eat. Oh my god, what a humongous meal. Oh man, she surely has to take a massive dump right now. Oh man. Where is she gonna go to take her massive shit? Maybe Glarthir wants me to collect a sample. That way we can examine it under some sort of microscope for some sort of microbial spies or some shit. Holy hell, you know that's gotta be what's going on with the ancient spies of whatever fucked up order she's a part of. <gasps> Look, she's going to go right there. <gasps> Look, she's some sort of foul sorcerer colliding right through the fucking gate. Oh my god. Look at this shit. What is going to fucking happen? Who the hell knows? Look at this. What's she doing? She's just kind of looking at these horses. <gasps> what have you been up to? Rumor has it the Nerevrin has left Lothian on an expedition to... Oh my god, is she the Nerevrin? It seems that these are turbulent times in the land of the Dunma. Turbulent. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, there she goes. Hey, is this Prior Mabel? Holy shit, this is Prior Mabel right here! Prior Mabel, give me some cover. Yeah. Oh shit, where's she going now? Uh-oh. See, who the hell is this guy? Tilmo. I got my eye on you, Tilmo. I got my fucking eye on you. That's right, Big Brother never stops watching, you sick son of a bitch. Let's head on in here and see where the hell she's going now. Look at, look at her fucking go. Where the hell is she going? She's going underneath some bridges and shit. Oh my god. Very, very sinister. Very suspicious. Oh my god. She's gonna summon out like a 12-dicked monster, I bet. Just, just you wait. Oh my god. And she's gonna milk it for all it's worth. Hot damn. You know that'll sell real good in, <laughs> in the swamps of Argonia. Oh shit. Is that our friend? Where's Glarthir? Looks like he's showing up on the dude Dara real close, isn't he? What the hell? What kind of weird shit? Do <gasps> oh shit. Alright, here we go. Oh my god, she's going back to the chapel. She grabbed some grapes, took a dump with the horses. What the fuck is next? Oh, oh shit. No, she's throwing us for a freaking loop. Where the hell are you going? I know what you're up to. Oh my god, look at that. There's some sort of outdoor area here for partying. What is this? <gasps> she's hoeing here? Of all places. What the hell, dude? Oh, that is messed up. Alright, let's 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 wait again. Let's let her hoe up. Hoe up and hoe down, baby. Oh shit, something's gonna happen. <gasps> Nothing happened. <laughs> Let's wait again. <laughs> wow, she's still hoeing here. Holy shit, she must be strong as hell. Oh my god, of course she is. Why wouldn't they employ one of the strongest operatives known to man? Holy shit, her biceps must be the size of fucking beach balls. Oh my god, we better be careful. If she sees us, she's gonna deck us all the way back to the Imperial City. God. Alright, let's wait again. Oh shit, what do you think's gonna happen? <gasps> what is she doing? Maybe this beggar knows something. What the hell is she doing? She's like eating some soup. Some ancient foul soup. Oh my god. What the fuck? Look at this messed up shit. She's still eating. My god. This must be her dinner. Good lord, we gotta wait again, because you know how long it takes for her to eat. A long, long, long ass time. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit, look. Right as the bell tolls, <gasps> she's on the fucking move again, and so are we. Hot damn. Look at this shit. Oh my god, we're sneaky as shit, dude. Holy crap, how many sneak levels are we gonna get on this fucking cool-ass mission? I think a fucking load of them, dude. 
So many, it's gonna blow our damn minds. Where'd she go? <gasps> she went back inside her house. Can we go inside of her house? It's... Oh, shit, we can't. Well, you know what that means. It's time to report. It's time to report back to Glarthir. And tell her all the... Tell him about all the weird shit she got up to. Because, holy fuck, it was a lot. Oh, my God. We got to tell him about all the weird dumps. Eating a whole lot of grapes. Eating a humongous breakfast. I mean, come on. Holy crap. She must be fueling for uh, all that hoeing that she does. Holy crap. And then with the sheep and... The, and that one guy talking about the Nerevarine? What the fuck? Alright, let's wait here for about three hours. That should be good enough, right? Here we go. So, you saw Bernadette Penanis, did you? Yeah. She was watching me and following me, wasn't she? What? I have nothing to report yet. You were right. She is following you. She wasn't watching or following you. No, you, dude, you were right. She fucking was. I could tell. I could tell that she was. She had an elaborate system of about 500 different mirrors set up and spying on you. I fucking knew it, dude. No, she, was, she wasn't watching or following you, Clarth here. What the fuck are you talking about? She wasn't doing any of that. Really? That is surprising. I was sure she was watching me. Maybe she was... Maybe she knew. Well, what about the reward you promised? Ah, of course. The gold. Here. Yeah. But there is someone else I need you to investigate. Oh, for fuck's sake. All right, what else do you want me to do? Tutius Sextius. Do you know him? <laughs> what a, a name! Fellow. Appears harmless enough, but I've identified him as one of my key suspects. Oh, shit. He's a clever one, no doubt about it. Eyes in the back of his head. Always seems to know when I'm watching. But that's where you come in. Hell yeah, You dude. should wait outside his house and see what he does when he's not watching me. I'll meet you here tomorrow night to get your report. All right, holy shit. Well, let's, tell, let's ask him about Bernadette. I still can hardly believe she wasn't watching me. But it is a relief to be able to finally stop worrying about her. All right. Well, what about Tutius Sextius? <laughs> what a name. He lives in the large house between the low gate and the east bridge. Alone. Suspicious, don't you think? Oh, yeah. Very fucking suspicious. All right. All right, Glarthier. Holy don't shit. Don't Tutius Sextius catch you following him. He's much more dangerous than he looks. I know. He sounds dangerous as shit, dude. Holy crap. All right, when next we come back, we're going to do another secret-ass fucking mission for Glarthia because, holy shit, I think this guy is onto something. I think he knows what the fuck is going down here in Skingrad, and it's fucking huge. We're going to blow the lid right off this case. Holy shit. We're going to blow this one wide fucking open, and we're going to get promoted to fucking vice and promoted to homicide, and holy shit, everyone's going to know about all this wild-ass shit. Oh, shit. It's the bald man himself. Okay, he's none the fucking wiser. Holy shit, you fucking idiot. <laughs> they aren't on to us! Till next time, peace! Peace!